Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Allie. If you're new to my channel, and welcome to Beauty with a Purpose. So if you are new to my channel, my name is Allie. I upload four videos a week, beauty, Bible, and lifestyle. So if any of those interest you, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's get into today's video. Okay, so for today's video, um, I wanna do like a holiday makeup look because I'm actually going to um, a women's Bible conference tonight. But I, you know, I thought I'd film me getting ready, but I wanted to do it for like Thanksgiving. A Thanksgiving makeup look because it's right around the corner so let's go ahead and I'm also playing with just a couple of things that I got in my ipsy this month so the first thing is or one of the things we'll be playing with is this violet Voss palette um, this doesn't really have a name it's just this one that looks like this so we're gonna be playing with this today creating a little look with that and then for mascara, we'll be using this Tristique Good Vibes Mascara. And it, it's a really fat-like thing, and it looks pretty trippy, because it's like, okay, there we go. So it says push to curl or flip down, wait, what? I guess flip down to curl the wand or to curl your lashes. Oh, so this is also an eyelash curler. This is kind of small to be an eyelash curler. Wow. That is not bad for curling out lashes, but y'all, I don't win. This little thing done got me all distracted in this video already. Anyways, it has an eyelash curler on there for you. So yeah, let's go ahead and just get into it. So primers so i'm going in with my i should probably use di oh, i don't want to use different primers just because i'm actually going somewhere tonight <laughs> and i'm using a new foundation combo so since i'm using a new foundation combo <laughs> i'm not going to use a new primer combo <laughs> so going in with my touch and soul prime essence and then my elf jelly pop primer how many of you guys noticed that when i did my one take get ready with me i forgot to prime my face <laughs> my okay and then as always our calming facial prime and setting is going in with my um profusion good brow day brow pencil like all my writing has already came off of this y'all Okay, and now I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my Maybelline Tattoo Studio Brow Pomade and my Profusion Eyebrow Brush and just start filling that in. I love this pomade because it's like my most natural pomade. And I always try to use a different pomade every month like just to see like, is it good enough? to override the pomade that I was loving in the previous month. Okay, so now that brows are done, we're gonna go in and clean them. I'm gonna use this Milani concealer today, mostly because I haven't used it in a long little while. You should have did a shop with me because that's basically how I picked all the makeup today is like, what makeup have I not used in a good little minute? Is how I picked out my makeup today. Obviously, except for the primers, because when you find a good primer combo, like, you cannot let that go. Cleaning your brows is such an unnecessary step. I never knew I needed in my life. Carving out, cleaning them up, highlighting, whatever you want to call it. Such an unnecessary step. But yet, so important to your brow game. Gonna add a little bit more concealer just to my lids, just to prime them for eyeshadow. Now we can go in with the eyeshadow palette. I'm I am gonna go ahead and set all over the lid with this one, just because it's close enough to skin tone shade that I don't think 
it'll do too much damage. Okay, and now I am going to go ahead and take Pretty Peach right here and apply that into my crease. The next one I'm gonna take is Teddy, and we're just gonna put that on the outer and then directly into our crease. We're not gonna buff it out like we did that pretty peach color. What brush is this? Yeah, this is my Morphe one. I can actually tell you what brush is this because it's just a single brush. And if this isn't like the perfect Thanksgiving makeup color scheme, like I don't know what is. And I'm gonna take chocolate and put that really on our outer V. Okay, so now, I mean, there's really only one shade that we can use, but what I wanna do is I wanna take this on the lid first and then I wanna take that shimmer and apply it on top. Just so that way we go ahead and use every single color in this little palette. And this one is called Coral Pop. I don't know if I said that already. Taking the shade that we're, the, pin, the, the brush that we had Teddy on. I'm just gonna blend that out. And then taking the brush we had Chocolate on. We're just gonna blend that edge right there. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is just take the other side of that brush and take the champagne shade, and now I'm gonna put that on top of that, where we put that coral, coral pop. See? Gives it just a little something, something. Okay, so now that that is done, I'm gonna go ahead and curl my lashes again using my lash curler. They're still pretty curled from the other one, but I'm using these Pro Fusion Iconic Foam Ink Lashes. These are in the style on my lashes, and so I'm just gonna go ahead and pop those on y'all, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so lashes are on. So the next thing we're this one this one's about to get on my nerves. So next thing we're going to move on to is foundation, and I have the ABH Luminous Foundation in the shade 330W, and then the BH Cosmetics Foundation in 2 White is basically what it is in 208 Medium Beige. One's too light, one's a tad bit too dark. I don't like this ABH foundation pump because it gets stuck. Still really orange. Blending that out with my Her Beauty Beauty Sponge. One reason I was gonna declutter that ABH foundation is because everybody's like, oh, the coverage is so good, yada, yada, yada. But every single time I use this foundation, like, I don't feel like the coverage is that good. And that's me not mixing it and with me mixing it. I don't feel like the coverage is all that, if you ask me. Like, that's my opinion. I just, I don't know. Could be wrong, y'all. I don't know. Let me know. Have y'all tried this foundation? What do y'all think about it? Do y'all agree with me? What do y'all think? Because like I said, I don't feel like the coverage is all of that. I've always had to build up. Always. And yes, I have used it with the foundation brush too. And same thing. I used it with the brush that it came with. The ABH A30 brush. She's actually one of my favorite foundation brushes. So, this is a little bit messed up over here. Like, what's, what happened over here on oh, this eye? Boy, if I am dewy and luminous. So now I'm taking the Milani Conceal and Perfect Concealer. And we're just gonna go ahead and apply, use this to highlight our face. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this one. This one, like I switched sponges or something. Just taking my sponge and blending that out. So 
So for powder, I have been trying out the Tarte Shape Tape Powder in the shade Translucent. I did get this in, the, in an Ipsy as well. So I really liked it with the Ordinary and Profusion Foundation combination. Just don't like the um, net in here. Like I feel like it doesn't. I don't know. I might tear the net because I don't like that. I, I don't know. I don't know. Oh yeah, you guys, on my lips, I have on this Fruit Butter Lip Mask from Seraphine Botanicals Beauty. And I got this in my Ipsy as well. It's really, really nice. I like it. Already like it. I'm gonna put it in my purse because I don't know what happened to my little lip balm that I had in there. But that one's going in there now. Okay, so face is set. We're gonna go ahead and finish up the lower lash line. You guys know I'm not gonna take any additional product. So I'm taking the for the the one that we had the shade um, peach peach treat or something like that. Oh, pretty peach. <laughs> Y'all, I suck with names. Me and Raquel have been talking like all day today, and we were talking about. <laughs> the oh my gosh raw beauty raw beauty christy and color pop collab and she's like what did you order and i was like oh i ordered the palette and this and that and i said like the wrong names for everything and i was like oh my bad it's this like i don't know where the heck because <laughs> i i remember seeing the names of stuff but like the names that i told her like y'all just made them up or something and sent them to her because when i went back and looked and i'm like now why did i tell her that was the name of what i got like, where was my mind at? So yeah, expect a video on that coming soon. There's a little surprise in that video. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and use this mascara on the lower lashes. Honestly, you guys, it didn't do much for the top lashes, so not expecting it to do much for my lower. This was one of the things that I wanted to save for a giveaway, but now that I'm using it, like I'm glad that I did it because I don't think this is good. Like, I wouldn't want to give this to somebody. And that's because my eyelashes have came a long way in the last couple of months. Okay, um, not really liking that. Um, let's go ahead and move on though. It's really, really wet and it's like transferring and stuff. So for bronzer, I'm going to use my Too Faced Chocolate Gold Soleil bronzer. And this is simply just to bronze up the skin because to contour, we are going in with the palette that I have not used, honestly, like since I bought it. This is like the first case of maskany that I've gotten and I think it's because I started doing Uber Eats. So I have to wear a mask when I pick up the food and when I drop it off. So, but to contour, we're using our Profusion Pro Contour Palette. And I'm going to mix these two and dip into them cheekbones. Them cheekbones. Ooh. Ooh, that one's a little bit muddy on me. I have to blend that out. Frank Karina, like, she uh, did her contour one day. She's like, do you think it's too much? She's like, I feel like it's too much. I was like, if you ever do your makeup and you feel like something's too much, like, rock it anyways, and nobody will question if you messed up or if it's too much, like wear it with confidence and nobody's gonna question anything. <laughs> okay, and then I also haven't used this Profusion blush palette in a while, so I think I'm going to take the color Lush and a little bit of Juicy. The other shades in this are super shimmery. I'm doing way too much. Somebody come get us. She dancing like a. Allie better stop. You know Jesus. So now I'm taking this Milani highlighter. And we're going to apply this to our cheekbones. But anyways, Brian and I are very real. about listening to secular music and things like that? Now we take it with a grain of salt. 
and we do it wisely but yeah some of them beats be hitting just gonna go ahead and set the bras with my all-time favorite it's the second ipsy puts this into their add-ons at a very discounted price i'm buying this just like i did with um the 111 skin the 111 skin atb sports booster serum Yep, bought that as soon as it went on sale because that thing's like a hundred something dollars retail. I got it on sale. I forgot to put this in the waterline, so I was waiting for that lower line mascara to dry. So I'm going to put it on right now. I feel like this lash is lifted a little bit, but I'm not sure. Like I feel a little, like, I don't know if it's just me, but like I feel like my eyelid, like it feels a little bit wet in there when the lash starts to lift. Is that just me? Am I tripping? Am I crazy? Does it feel like that for everybody? I'll let that dry a little bit. Let's go ahead and move on to the lips. Gotta wipe this off. I love the way that feels. We're gonna try lips look. And we are going in with our dark brown lip liner from e.l.f. And now we are going to take, I've been loving this this month, you guys. And this is the ColourPop Ultra Blotted, Ultra Blotted Lip in the shade Cypress. So we're gonna go ahead and curl our lashes one more time. Don't know what's going on with this lash. Okay, I'm gonna take my Milani Make It Last spray today. I'm gonna try not to spray my lashes too much because they already set tripping for me. They already set tripping for me, so. All right, you guys, so that is it for today's video. My skin ain't looking the best, but this lip combo with this eye, I'm loving it. So yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I just thought that this would be like a fun, like, like I don't think it gets any more Thanksgiving vibes than this look right here. I don't know. I'm pretty proud of myself. I like it. But yeah, you guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you haven't already, you guys, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Remember that I love you, but Jesus loves you more. Bye, guys. Mwah!